Hey everybody, it's Pat. You want to know the difference between Super Cruise and Tesla full self-driving? Um, one, Super Cruise can pretty much only do it on mapped roads, so mainly highways uh, around the around the country. And it drives like a, a nervous new driver um, that's unsure of itself and isn't sure where it's supposed to be half the time. Um, it still does a great job. It, it's, it's awesome that I don't have to, um, you know, uh, use all my muscles to constantly be steering the vehicle for long drives it just makes the drive that much more relaxing but I will say that the Tesla full self-driving in my experience has been far superior um, as far as not just what it's capable of doing but even when it's doing the same thing like driving down the highway it's just more confident and sure of itself um, it, it drives more like a normal person I would say and if you turn it to a hurry mode it drives like someone from California or Chicago so you know nothing wrong with that um, and absolutely love the, the ability to compare the differences between the two I'm super happy that um, this is the direction we're going in regards to technology as a pilot I absolutely love the idea of having um, automation to help assist us in everyday tasks that we do um, you know the, the correlation between full self-driving and autopilot is is right there for me so uh, hope everyone has a great day and let me know if you have any questions or comments take care